The Petite Basset Griffon Vendéon, or PBGV for short, is a small dog with a big, lively personality. Originating from the Vendéon region of western France, it descends from a larger breed called simply the Griffon Vendéon. It was then honed over many generations of careful breeding to create an excellent scent hound. This breed has a rough coat that enables it to hunt amid the dense rocks and underbrush near the Atlantic coast. The coat color is usually some combination of light brown, black, and white. Once it came into the possession of French royalty, this breed obtained the nickname of the Chiens du Roy, or the King's White Hounds. In English, this breed has earned the nickname of Ruffy. In French, this breed has a very descriptive name that refers to the dog's small size, petite, wiry coat of hair, griffin, and place of origin, vendéon. Basset also means low set or low to the ground. Despite its popularity in French hunting, it is a relative niche breed that only arrived in the United States in the 1970s. The American Kennel Club finally recognized it on December 1, 1990. The PBGV is a healthy breed with a life expectancy between 12 and 14 years of age. The most common health problems include ear infections, hypothyroidism, epilepsy, and primary open angle glaucoma, damage of the optic nerve resulting in visual field loss. The PBGV is also sometimes affected by an autoimmune pain syndrome that results in pain, fever, and lethargy in dogs 6 to 18 months of age. This problem usually resolves on its own, but in rare cases, the dog can be stuck with permanent symptoms. The PBGV is also sometimes called the happy breed for its affectionate and exuberant personality. Few other breeds can match this dog for sheer affability. This makes it well suited as a therapy dog or companion in addition to its superb hunting instincts. It does have a tendency to bark, howl, or wail quite loudly. Although not every owner will find this to be an appealing trait, it does have an important purpose as a greeting or alert call. This breed isn't all constant noise and motion though. As long as it gets enough playtime and stimulation, it does know how to settle down and relax. The PBGV is a bit of an attention seeker that thrives in the company of other people or animals. As long as it has companionship, the maintenance and care requirements aren't particularly high. Like all dogs, this breed should receive an annual checkup at the vet, even if it appears otherwise healthy. For the best behavioral results, you should obtain your dog as a puppy and begin training as soon as possible. The PBGV requires approximately 1.5 to 2 cups of high-quality dry food, preferably divided into two meals every single day. The dog food should be chosen based on its appropriate age, puppy, adult, or senior. This breed does have a tendency to gain weight. The best way to counteract this is to carefully monitor your dog's calories and limit treats to training times. If you want any special advice on your dog's diet, then you should consult the vet. The PBGV has a rough, wiry coat that may require weekly brushes to remove loose dirt and hair, followed by the use of a comb. It is not hypoallergenic, so people with allergies may want to be wary. Nail trimming and ear cleaning should be done on a regular basis, but only bathe the dog when it is particularly dirty after an outdoor excursion. The PBGV is a stubborn breed that has a mind of its own, but with a bit of patience, this dog can excel at tricks, performances, and basic commands. A gentle but firm approach should be sufficient to keep the dog's attention. Do not lash out at it or the dog might become discouraged. If the dog's attention appears to be wandering, then you should try to stay one step ahead and refocus its attention with games, treats, or other incentives.
The PBGV is a highly energetic breed that requires up to an hour of excise every single day. When you're outside on a walk, run, or hike, it is a good idea to keep this breed on a leash, because it has the tendency to follow scents everywhere. When inside, toys, games, and tricks should keep it busy for a long time. This breed is also able to learn tricks and sports with ease as long as its attention is focused. Due to the long coat, this breed has a tendency to become warm, so make sure it has frequent rests and water breaks in hot weather. Socialization and training from an early age are very important for this breed. The dog may never entirely overcome its tendency to follow its nose but this instinct can be greatly minimized and reduced. It is a good idea to buy the puppy from a high-quality breeder who takes special care of the health of its dogs. You should also take the dog to the vet for an early checkup and health screening.